Rabbi Lynn? Yes. I'm not stressed. I'm trying, yes. sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm, not, I'm trying to make this flyer, and I just really have no idea what color to make this flyer. Yeah, I really don't know. Color. I really don't, yeah. No, no, Rabbi Lynn, it's do. really important because my uh, the thing that I need from you like is very much dependent on what she needs. Okay, just, uh, what were the choices again? Pink or yellow or green or red. Oh, go, go with okay. the Go with the <laughs> I should, I should, okay. Oh. okay. Yeah, it was good. What did you need? Purple? Tissue. I don't tell him. Tell him. Where's the tell him? Why is it so hard to make such a okay, why, why don't Why don't the two of you go decide what you think and then you can come back and let me know? Remember, let me be talking about this for hours. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so, how about blue? Then no, can you just can you just say uh, th- it should be blue? It needs to be blue, and then I'll feel comfortable and make the flyer blue if you just say it. Must make it blue. Rabbi Lynn, Rabbi Lynn, the girls are coming back late for curfew. Like they came back at eleven oh one, but I don't know if I should tell Suri or if I should tell like Mrs. Cullen or can you just answer, Rabbi Lynn? Rabbi Lynn, Rabbi Lynn, I really need to talk to you. I think I'm becoming a Peron mom. I don't know what to do. I don't want to be a Peron mom. It's my biggest fear. I, I don't know what to do. Rabbi Lynn! Rabbi Lynn! We need your help. We, we need, need to go to spot right now. <laughs> we need to go on Monday. We need to go get there like five days early for Shabbos. Yes. Rabbi Lynn, you want to see me? Yeah, thank you, Rabbi Bell. Come in. Close the door. What's up this time? <laughs> <laughs> Rabbi Bell, I need your help. Another national crisis? No national crisis. Nothing to do with Wuhan? Nothing to do with Wuhan. Okay. I can't find a second for myself. Every second people are asking me questions, people are barging into my office, people are calling me. Why don't you take some time off and work from home? Take some time at home? Yeah, nice relaxing. Without life. anybody bothering me, without anybody asking me questions. Exactly. Oh, I'm Agreed. sorry, wait, wait, one second, I have, a que- I have a call here. Hello? Wow, can you drive me to the mall today? I love you. Give me a new Robux cube. Oh, could you buy me a new doll? I'll be on later. Okay, no, that's not gonna work. Not gonna work? No. Okay, <clears throat> let's go to Plan B. Why don't you go to America? Wow, <clears throat> America. Sorry, hang on one second. Yeah. Hello? Oh my gosh, Rabbi Lynn, you don't even understand how the most important question I think you will ever answer in your entire life. So basically, my uncle's brother's test bike sister was talking about riding unisex on Shabbos, but then realized that the mini microwave wasn't even captured, so we had to take the bike to get a toy pool. But then, it just so happens that Yeshiva Week was this week, so that obviously we can't just throw out the whole Pikuach Nefesh issue. So what I'm really trying to say is, would it be a halakhic issue to use blue ribbons on Pesach? Okay, please get back to me really, really soon because I really need to know. Thank you. Uh, 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 it's a good question. I'll answer you later. Uh, okay, that's not going to work either. Not going to work? No. What Too many that? alumni in America. That was an alumni? Yeah. Okay, just to get idea. those things done, think, I learn. I have an idea. I have a guy. I have a has, guy. I have a guy who has an experimental spaceship. His name is uh, Elon Musk. Uh, but they're friends, <clears throat> and you can. I can get you on that flight, and you can. Flight to where? Los Angeles? You no, know, flight to space. Flight to space. Yes, it's safe, and. Um, it's been tested by monkeys, but, <laughs> but it, it should be okay. Um, and and what, I'm just going to space and I'm just going to be up there, then what? I think they have Wi-Fi. But anyway, <clears throat> um, then you have plenty of time to be on your own, R&R, solitude. Nobody's going to bother you there. What do you think? Rabbi Rebel, you're brilliant. Wow, a real spaceship. How do you make it move? Take off. Try it. Whoa! No, he's not a man. Okay, so he said he's not a man. He's totally gone. Gone a He disappeared. Um, has anyone put up signs that maybe he's that maybe? Did did anyone talk to the police? Well, you think he's missing? I don't know. Like he's not on phone. Rabbi Lynn always answers the phone. So should we should we put his name in the home to healing groups or something? I hope he's safe. But like we really like, you know, I mean, I hope he's okay. But like, right, we but must dance. We need. Ah, oh, finally, away from all the pressures. 
No more need for this. No more need for this. Ah, oh, ready to just sit back and relax. Mrs. Spitz, you will not believe what I just found upstairs. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> what did you find? I found a little lamb. Wait, what? A little lamb. A lamb is an, an Mary, animal? Mary, Mary had a little lamb. And now it's Meroth had a little lamb. <laughs> Okay, so I think we have to speak to our villain about this. Like, honestly, what are we going to do? Like, where are we going to put it? What are we going to do with it? No, we <laughs> cannot have the sheep in Okay, there. let's try to get in touch with him. Okay, this is going to be fun. Okay. I mean, he said that he's available, right? Like, we yeah. call him whenever he, you know, he said. <laughs> Should we try what's up? Yeah. What do you get to drink up here? I have this instant coffee. Oh, I missed the coffee machine at Mount Road. I never worked anyway. Okay, Rabbi Lynn, this is really urgent. <laughs> Sheep in the door. <laughs> you may have some anxious feelings, as though you need to be somewhere else. Okay. I don't know, he's not answering. He's not answering. Shakol near Hmm, this food tastes different. Oh. Probably because it's kosher. After all that time eating food cooked in the Maro kitchen, I forgot what kosher food tasted like. We need to get in touch with him. Oh my gosh, I'm falling asleep. It's so, I'm so tired. Hey, the speaker. You know, the girls always thought I played that music to wake them up. Little did they know. I want it on six. Well, I want it on fourteen. I don't want it on at all. <laughs> I don't miss my road. What are we gonna do? We have to go to Strawberry Lynn. We just have to go to him. Where is he? He's not answering us. I'm so frustrated. <laughs> six months later. Oh, I just can't get enough of this relaxing. This is the best being so far away from all those pressures. What's this? The phone box! I forgot! I used to pass this around the Morrow classroom. I used to watch girls put their phone between their legs while they said they didn't have it and pass it to the next person. I used to take it back at the end lovingly as I was about to teach Torah to a bunch of people who didn't know how to live without their phones. I miss my life at Morrow. Are we Bell? Yeah, hi. Thanks for getting me this special space phone plan. I really appreciate it. Yeah, listen, it's been amazing up here, but I miss my road. It's time for me to come home. Button under the desk. Got it. Woo! Robert Rebel. Robert Rebel, the directions were perfect. I'm heading right through the road, but I think I'm gonna go straight through the roof. I'm coming right out the building. No, there's no stopping it. I'm heading right for the roof. In 10 seconds, I'm going to hit 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, 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 I made it. Oh, what are we going to do about this roof? Did you really think it was the leak that made that hole? Jeder einer dabend im Beit im Wald, Farmaschiach, er will schon kommen, er wart auf dir in mir. Ich bin ein Farmer, 
Maschia Revent, na Kimmen, wenn wir vertrügen sich. Jede eine Daben, immer beten, wir warten, fahren, Maschia. Ewig schon Kimmen, ey, warten auf die Demi. Aha, 